इंटरेस्टिंग डिविजन प्रॉब्लम्स पार्ट फोर टुडे वी विल लर्न हाउ टू डिवाइड लार्ज नंबर्स टुडे मम्मी हैज ब्रॉट अ न्यू स्कूल बैग फॉर वंदना वंदना इज वेरी हैप्पी टू सी हर न्यू बैग शी आस्क्स हर मदर मॉम हाउ मच डिड दिस बैग कॉस्ट It cost four hundred and fifty-nine rupees. Look, there also is a tag on it. Vandana sees the tag in the bag. It has four hundred fifty-nine written on it. Vandana is finding it very expensive. Mom, this is very expensive. Yes, it is expensive. But I liked it, so I bought it. What was the cost of my old bag? The cost of this bag is equal to your three old bags. Now, you can find the cost of the old bag yourself. Got it. If three bags cost four hundred and fifty-nine rupees, so to find out how much a bag is worth, I divide four hundred and fifty-nine by three. Right, mummy? Perfect, Vandana. Now quickly find out and tell me the cost. Of your old bag, can you do that for me? To divide four hundred and fifty-nine by three, I first write it like this. But how will I divide such a large number by three? I do not know. Vandana does not know how to divide big numbers, so she asks her mother. Mummy, teach me to divide big numbers, please. Okay, Vandana. It is easy to divide big numbers, okay? See, when you have to divide big numbers, then don't divide the whole number together. Just divide it digit by digit. Like we will not divide this whole number, but instead we will divide the first digit 4 by 3. Okay, now you divide. Okay, mummy. So if I divide 4 by 3, the answer is 1 and 1 is left. I have divided the first number. Now, what should I do now, mummy? Now, the remainder which is left, let's write one digit from the remaining numbers near it. Okay? See, the remainder is one. The remaining number is fifty-nine. So, the first digit of fifty-nine will be written down near one, like this. Now, look, the number here is fifteen. Now, you have to divide fifteen by three. Come on. Okay, mummy. Three ones are three. Three twos are six. Three threes are nine. Three fours are twelve. Three fives are fifteen. That's it. So when fifteen is divided by three, the answer came five, and the remainder is zero. Perfectly done, Vandana. Now repeat the same sequence with the rest of the digits. Now the remainder is zero. Let's write the next number nine near it. Now you have to divide nine by three. Come on. Okay, mummy. Three ones are three. Three twos are six. Three threes are nine. So the answer after dividing nine is three, and remaining is zero. You are absolutely right, Vandana. Now look. There is no digit left to divide, so this means that the whole number is divided by three, and the answer is one hundred and fifty-three. That means if we divide four hundred and fifty-nine into three equal parts, one part will have one hundred and fifty-three. Yes, that means my old bag came for one hundred and fifty-three rupees. Yes, Vandana. But mother, how will we know that this answer is correct? Very easy. Multiply one hundred and fifty-three by three, and see if the answer came to four hundred and fifty-nine. Then you divided it correctly. Okay, mummy, I'll try and multiply them. Three threes are nine. Three fives are fifteen. So at one's place is five, and at ten's place is one. So while multiplying, we keep one's digit at its designated place. And we keep the digit at tens place here. It will be written like this: three ones, three. 
After adding the carried over 1, the answer is 4. Oh yes, mummy. After multiplying 153 by 3, the answer came equal to 459. That means I have divided correctly. Yes, Vandana. In exactly the same way, you can divide any big number, alright? It is very easy, mummy. Now I will be able to easily divide any big number. Today we learned how to divide big numbers.